one it's the right one tv i'm that girl i'm that right one that's gonna keep you updated on celebrity news so if you're new welcome to my channel and make sure to subscribe so you never miss a video and hit that notification bell as well and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for all the love and support it really means a lot to me so let's get straight into it everyone hey you guys i'm back radar online is the gift that keeps on giving they are on top of it today and i got some tea for you guys and let's get to this article a judge has ordered a injunction in favor of cardi b against a woman who claimed to be the rapper's friend when making wild accusations online according to court documents obtained by radar a new york judge granted a default judgment against star marie ebony jones for those who don't know a day later i kid you not star marie jones got on different platforms and was speaking out against Cardi B and doubled down on what Tosh K said. This woman's been in hiding for three years. There was even talks around the street that that woman was in Africa somewhere. But no, clearly she's back in the United States and they served her with some papers. So Star Marie, she can't say nothing now, honey. Cardi B got that mouth on zip. Cardi B said it's up and it's stuck. And I cannot believe this. I thought she was taking Tasha K back to court. No, she came for Star Marie now. She said, I know where you at. Cardi B played hide and go seek. She found Star Marie. But let me get back to the article, you guys. I'm sorry. Jones claimed she was a former friend of Cardi on the podcast. The two accused the Bodak Yellow rapper working as a prostitute and having STDs and using hard drugs. On the September 13, 2018 podcast, Star Marie said Cardi is just a Grammy-nominated prostitute running around spreading herpes. She also claimed Cardi used you-know-what and you-know-what. I don't want to say it, but some hard drugs. Cardi also sued Tasha in a separate lawsuit. She was awarded over $4 million in damages from a jury in January. The judgment included $25K in medical expenses and another $1.3 to cover Cardi legal fees. Tasha was found liable for defamation, invasion of privacy, and intentionally infliction of emotional distress. Whoa! Cardi B is not playing. During the trial, Cardi B testified that she felt extremely, you know what, after watching the video. She said only an evil person could do that. Cardi said the statement caused issues with her husband, Asuk. The rapper said she struggled to be romantic with her man and had to see a therapist over it. The lawsuit against Star Marie has been going on quietly in New York. Cardi alleged former friend blew off the lawsuit despite being properly served with the legal papers. In the suit, Cardi said Star Marie caused her to suffer embarrassment, humiliation, mental anguish, and emotional distress. As a result, the judge ordered that Star Marie's statement that Cardi had engaged in prostitution and has or had herpes defamatory. Further, the court permanent enjoined from posting, reposting, publishing, or continue to publish in any way the defamatory statements about Cardi. However, it does make note that all videos posted with defamatory statements have to be taken down immediately. So with all that being said, if, if anybody got any interviews with Star Marie on their platform, baby, y'all better take it down because Cardi B is watching. She said it's up and it's stuck. Wow, that was a lot. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Are you shocked? Star Marie finally got caught up, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye. And I know your taste is a little bit mm, high maintenance. Mm, everybody else basic. You live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice. Poetic justice.